On this video I'm going to show you how to connect to uh, Microsoft SQL Server 2008. So uh, this uh, system already has set up the server and also SQL Server Management Studio. Okay. So uh, I have uh, set up the, that server using uh, Mixit. Uh, server authentication, both uh, Windows and SQL Server. So this is my uh, super user, super administrator, or sysadmin uh, user. So I connect with uh, with it, uh, and here on the databases, I'm going to create a new database. New database. Okay. And on that database, I'm going to create a new table. This is the first field, integer, description, and chart. I'm going to set it to 40, and that's it. This is just a simple uh, first table. Okay, so now this is the table, and I can enter information there. This is a test another test close this warning uh, description and so on ok so this is the store here so now I'm going to open rad PHP and on the databases on the data explorer I'm going to add a new connection which is called new database for example and now I'm going to edit the connection parameters. On server name I enter the instance name SQL Express. Database name is new database and here I'm using my super user credentials. Test the connection, succeed. And here I can for example get all the data for the table, add new one and so on. So now uh, I'm going to show you uh, how to do mm, how to uh, use that uh, table and database from PHP. The first thing you need to do is to edit the PHP INI template, which is on the PHP folder on your uh, Rad PHP setup, and search for MS SQL. To enable this e extension, this line. So I'm removing the, the comment here. This line enables PHP to uh, access uh, Microsoft SQL Server. So this is what you need to do to, to enable. So I'll save that file and now I'm going to create a new form. Packages are being loaded for PHP components. And now I'm going to select a QDB grid to be created when I drop a table into the form. So this is what I get. And I get the database component, driving na driver name MS SQL, the host, the username, password, and this is the table and so on. So I run without debugging. I save this. And here I'm getting my table on the DB grid. So as you can see, it's very uh, straightforward to to use my uh, Microsoft SQL Server 2008 with uh, Rad PHP XE. Thank you.